My name is Daniela Frie, and I teach at St. Laurent Adult Center in Ville Celera. I teach Math 416. I decided to record my lessons just as I presented in class. The lessons were recorded using screen capturing and audio so that students may have a second chance at going through the steps. I did it in two phases. Earlier on, I recorded the lessons and I placed the recordings on the computer in the school where students could go after school or whenever they like to listen to the recordings and take notes and um, it helped. When I learned about how I may share these files using Google Drive through a workshop with Avi, that is when it took off better or it improved. I recorded my lessons um, every day and then I would put them up on Google Drive along with exercises related to the different recordings and solutions to the exercises and I would share it with all the students in the class and with that I saw improvement in the grades that the students were obtaining and also their confidence uh, I would say that it made them more confident about it. I think it does benefit all the different types of students one might have in a class. So the very weak students are able to listen to the lessons at home and then pause, stop, take notes, Google a word or two. The average students are able to just simply follow what is being said in class and then later on once they see that something is not clear they may go to the recording and take better notes. Now the above average of those who are very comfortable in a traditional class can still benefit and they do benefit by simply being able to do things ahead of the class. Now how they're able to do that in my classes I'm I'm not only sharing the recordings I'm doing for the current session with them but I do make available the recordings from the previous session as well so that students that are comfortable with what we are doing whenever it is we are covering such a topic they can choose to just simply at the same time just listen to what we are going to do next that way they are able to get ahead of the class in class for every module we essentially go through the lessons so that they can have everything they need to know so they have a week a week and a half to work together to go back to videos to go back to any lessons and then we have a test or an exam. Regardless of how one wants his class to be structured, this can be done. It takes organization and it takes having the student understand why things are being done the way they are and it usually goes well. As I'm teaching, I tell them, if you don't understand now for whatever reason, if you have a question that I can answer to help you understand, I will. But if you don't know what it is that is not making you understand, then don't force it. It's okay. Later on, when you watch the video, you might have the question that needs to be answered so that you come back to me the next day and I'll answer it. Or even watching it over again, things might be clearer. So during the lesson, it is being recorded and it assures the students that, you know what, if I don't get it now, it's okay. I don't have to beat myself up right now. I can always go back and then learn this thing.